there is one thing that stands out pretty heavily. And with all due respect, in case she does listen to this, yeah. I mean, Sorry, she, mom. <laughs> oh yeah, no, it's okay. She was a great cook. She really did stay away from a lot of the process stuff. It was a treat. Mm. You know, she, she cooked well, but we did have all those fun junk foods in the house. Mm -hmm. But um, the thing that got me the most was there was a time where she referred to me as having such a pretty face mm -hmm. and I could do better in her own words. And I just remember she, again, my, she was trying to motivate me, but what it did was the reverse and it made me want to rebel against not only her, but the world and myself. Yeah. And I did. And it was always with food. My mom was just trying to help me because she believed that thin was in. Thin was in. You heard it all the time. Thin is in. Thin was in. Well, I remember my dad would, when my mom was cooking, when I was little, I remember looking up at both of them and I remember my mom was cooking and she was dishing up her plate. And I remember my dad looking over and go, are you going to eat that? Like, are you seriously going to eat that? Like you're overweight. Like, what are you doing? It's funny how, when we hear these things, when we're little, how our brain is so malleable and that's where, this is where it all starts. 